Don't miss a beat, join the notification squad by clicking that bell, you'll get notified every time I upload a video, and be sure to join our Discord to talk and get help with your code. Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Ned. Welcome back to another episode of the Discord.js coding tutorial series. Today we're going to be doing a cooldown function kind of deal. It's going to be a pretty short tutorial. I'm sure you know that by the time that is that you saw already, but let's go ahead and jump right into it. So say you have someone like me spamming the, or the number one over and over again, and you don't want them to do that. So what we can do is set a cooldown, and we're going to be using a set. So let's go ahead and go here. And we can go all the way to the top. We want to make this at the top. And we're going to do, actually, let me close some of the stuff. There we go. So let's go ahead and do let cooldown equal new set. And you don't need any other packages for this. You just need that. Um, and then you can also do let uh, cd seconds equal five. This is just cooldown seconds. It's just going to make it a lot easier um, whenever we go to the set timeout function down below. All right, so now that we have that all set up, we can go ahead and start making it so it adds up each ID to the cooldown. So the way we're going to do that is we're going to go down here and we're going to look for, let me find it. So it looks like, do we have it in here? Okay, we don't. So if message dot content dot starts with prefix and we want to make this if it doesn't we're gonna return because at this point we don't really care um, as long as they got their XP and their coins we're fine so we can just go ahead and return it if it doesn't start with a prefix but if it does we're going to do cooldown and we can even like do something like if um, message dot member dot has permission doesn't well doesn't with that exclamation point there. Never forget that. Say administrator, and then we can do cool down dot add message dot author dot id, and now we can do. Or rather, we can do up here if they're already part of that. If cooldown dot has member, or rather, message dot author dot id message dot delete, and you can send an embed here. I'm just gonna go ahead and send a message. Message dot reply. You have to wait five seconds between commands. And we are gonna set this up for commands just to make it easier. You can go ahead and do slow mode if you wanted to. That'd be pretty cool if you wanted to do that. Um, take this and tutorial a step further. Um, but for now, that's all we need to do. And we can just go down here and make a set timeout function. So set timeout. All right, so. Let me get this set up right. Arrow function. All right, so cooldown dot delete message dot author dot ID. And then down here, we're going to do comma and we can do CD seconds times, oops, times 1000. And that's going to be because it's milliseconds, so it's going to be 5,000 milliseconds, which is 5 seconds, which is what we set all the way up here. So let's go ahead and save that, open my tutorial file, hit start. All right, so everything is loaded. Let's go ahead and do, let's go ahead and spam coins if you, well, for it to work, we'll have to do, just to show you. We'll have to get rid of the permissions. So I'm going to go ahead and comment that out. And save it. And then run again. Let it all load up. So coins. Prefix is not defined. It should be. Oh, yeah. Uh, 
so let's go ahead and just pop that bad boy up there. Rookie mistakes here, guys. Uh, yes. Start that up again. Coins. All right, so I'm pretty dumb. Our prefix isn't exclamation point, so let's go ahead and set it to that. All right, so coins. All right, so that message is just the money. Um, but yeah, so coins again. All right, so I'm really dumb, guys. Um, if you don't return, it's not going to stop it. So let's go ahead and add that return message out reply and start the bot up again. And we should be good to go. So let's go ahead and do coins and now coins again. All right. So it deleted it and sent that message there. As you can see, let's see if we can get a couple in a row. So there you go. Um, that's going to be it for today, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. Sorry for such a short tutorial. Hopefully, I'll have a better tutorial for Friday. Um, I'll be streaming all week, basically, during the night. So if you don't follow that, make sure you follow us on Twitch. We do it on YouTube as well. Um, so, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.